sure you check out our new sponsor, The Health Blaze. All the information is in the description. Use the promo code above. Good filler one boxing, 18% off of all their natural products from deodorant, pomade, toothpaste, and much, much more. And they have additional discounts on their website as well. That's thehealthblaze.com. Start December 20th. That promo code is good for 18% off. We go. All right, we back. Good for the Sports TV. Appreciate everybody for checking in. And um, it's kind of a question that's going around social media. I'm close it out. Uh, just talking about this whole topic. I talked about the Diddy situation with Lori, with Lori Harvey and stuff of that nature. And um, you know, internet asking is Diddy on social media asking is Diddy wrong for dating Lori Harvey, Steve Harvey's stepdaughter. Is I think it might be a 20, 30 year age gap. Don't quote me on that. But that's not you know that's not the thing about it. Miss Harvey used to date his son. All right, it's pictures of them. They used to date, and people are are saying, is it wrong for Diddy to date her because she dated his son? You know, and in my opinion, like, yeah, you know what I'm saying. And, you know, and no matter how secure you are with yourself or insecure you are, or you claim to be, or you you actually are, his relationship with his son could be unbreakable bond. But even the most unbreakable bonds, they can have chips and start to break. And obviously, no matter how much he did for his son, he always gonna love him. That's his blood, you know. Um, you know, but that just got to make you feel some type of way. Yo, daddy, you feel me? Yo, daddy, messing with your ex girlfriend. Now I don't know what shit was a fling or whatever, or they was just you know checking it out. But like, I, I assume that he smashed. Okay, I'm talking about his son. I assume that he smashed. So how can a girl that you smash, right, become your stepmother if they get married? And Diddy and Steve Harvey and the girl, they all went on a date together. They all went on like a little family get together. That's weird, bro. Out of all the women in America, out of all the bad women from here, from America to Europe, to Canada, Mexico, to, to Asia, all to Australia, everywhere. Like, in the back of his mind, no matter how cool he is, he can sit down, chop it up, give him a Ferrari, you know, whatever. Like, that shit fuck up somebody's mind. In my opinion, that would mess up somebody's mind. It's like, you know, these dudes with mothers that when their friends come over, they get to shaking their ass and they get to dancing and they get to wearing these short clothes when their friends come over and they teenagers. Like, that 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 type of thing stains somebody, stains a, a, a boy's Men, men, uh, mentally, that's staying them, you know, and that's you know a lot of a lot of toxic mothers don't necessarily have to be toxic in a way of you had old girl on social media saying her baby was ugly, or you know they can be toxic in a whole different type of way. You feel me? They could be toxic by you know wearing all these, all these skimpy clothes, or you know I seen a girl that got that got kids on social media, right? And I don't know her nothing. Just hop up on the sideline. She got this whole little. Uh, outfit out and it's see-through and she don't have no bra on her titties just out and shit you know what i'm saying you know and if she got and i believe she got kids she got kids and her son see her wearing shit like that and and that shit that shit mentally like sometimes mothers can be toxic and don't even know it you know and just don't think nothing of it and that's kind of like you know diddy being toxic his son may be okay with it he might move on but really when he hit home you know if he get around his home boy, it's like nigga like, no matter how cool y'all, this nigga like, man, this nigga daddy. It's Diddy, though, you feel me? But this nigga daddy smashed his ass girlfriend. Like 50 said, that's some like some porn plot shit. And that mentally messes with guys. But guys know how to hide they, they true feelings so well. And unfortunately for a lot of guys and a lot of people that can pretty much put it deep down and try to seal it up, eventually it's going to come out. You know, we may not hear about it or... Or whatever he might have told him, like hey, it's kind of weird, but hey, if you happy, you happy. Like the chances of Diddy marrying Lori Harvey right now, probably, you know, it's probably some chance. But it, you know, he was with Cassie all them years and didn't marry her. You know, old girl that just that just passed away that he had kids with. He told me I'm ready to marry her after she didn't passed away and y'all got kids and stuff together. So the chances of her marrying her, it's, it, you know, right now it's just a fling and the honeymoon phase and. After you get past that that six month period and you start really creeping on, you know, 13, 14, 15, 18 months, like like once you get past that little honeymoon period, you know, then you try you start to see if they in it for the long haul. You know what I'm saying? But you know, if it was in his position and, and he rich and people said, If I had this money, I wouldn't care, 
that's still emotionally and mentally messing with people. And I, and I know it messes with them. You know what I'm saying? Right now, right now he might be like, you know what I'm saying? They ain't gonna lie. But if they get married, you feel me? If they get married or, or some stuff, some stuff like that, and she become his stepmom, like how 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 weird is that? Your stepmom used to be your girlfriend. That's some redneck type stuff, you know what I'm saying? But hey, you know, it is what it is, but yeah, it's it's strange to me. You know, but all the women in the world and Diddy had to choose her out of all the young women, beautiful women. And I, I and one thing I ain't mad, at least he ain't go on Instagram and, and try to wife Instagram thought of. You know what I'm saying? I think the old head got more knowledge than that. You got you got you got you got a whole bunch of rich rappers and, and athletes that's making Instagram models uh, uh wealthy with their penis or or just open up their cash book just to hit. Yeah, shit crazy. You got them jumping in their DMs and stuff of that nature, but Lori Harvey come for some money, but Steve Harvey ain't got Diddy money, all right? And once again, another man making a, a, a woman rich. You don't see no, 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 no billionaire women, you know what I'm saying? Making no thousand year or millionaire niggas rich. You rarely see that. Women always date up. Maybe not always in looks, as far as what they use up, but they always financially date up, especially when they get older. That's why you see... The high school girls getting smashed by the grown men because the little niggas she go to school with, unless they, you know, get it, whatever they doing, they financially can't pay her a phone bill, give her some, pay her, buy her some clothes, buy her some Jordans or something like that. Women, usually women that's a mature, they always date up financially. You know what I'm saying? They want to be taken care of, especially without girls without a father. And sometimes girls with a father, they want to be taken care of like their daddy never did or like their daddy took care of them. They looking for that financial, that grown man security. And women, you know, obviously they mature. I see in a lot of cases they usually mature more faster than dudes do. But that's what it is. You don't see Rihanna going to get no multi-millionaire nigga and she worth $650 million. You don't see Beyonce going to get a, a, a multi-million dollar dude, even if he got all the potential in the world. She dated Jay-Z. He worth a billion. Only men sit there and make women <laughs> wealthy. You know what I'm saying? Broke women wealthy. You don't see too many cases. Now, you have cougars that'll mess with young dudes and stuff of that nature. You know, you got cougars that'll mess with you, but they're not going to get pregnant in, or they're not going to really take care of you. In some situations, there's exceptions to every rule, but hey, to me, it seemed a little weird, but I think it'll it, 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 it become bothersome if, if Diddy end up mar marrying uh, Lori Harvey, I think her name is. But hey, let me know what you think in the comment section. Tap in. Make sure you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Check out our sponsor, the Hellblaze, at thehelpblaze.com. Promo code Goodfellow on boxing to 18% off the 100% all natural products, lotion, soaps, foot soaks, bath bombs, deodorant, toothpaste, hair part made, much, much more. Website, promo code description. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Appreciate the love, support. Best way to help the channel out is share the videos one time for the one time. It's your boy CJ Goodfellow. We gone.